repairing BMW FRM3 with Zorce Multiprog automatically. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, your ultimate destination for all things automobile diagnostic tools and programmers. If you're passionate about understanding the inner workings of your vehicle and keeping it in top-notch condition, you're in the right place. From in-depth reviews to step-by-step -step tutorials, we've got it all covered. So, before we dive into today's video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon so you never miss an update. Let's get started. The Zorce Multiprog tool makes repairing the BMW FRM3 footwell module straightforward and efficient, automating much of the process. Below is a step-by-step -step guide to repair the FRM3 module using the Zorce Multiprog. Steps to repair BMW FRM3 with Zorce Multiprog. 1. Prepare the setup. Ensure you have the Zorce Multiprog tool and the necessary cables. Connect the Zorce Multiprog to your computer. Connect the FRM3 module to the Zorce Multiprog following the wiring diagram provided by Zorce. 2. Choose D-Flash Backup. Open the Zorce Multiprog software on your computer. Navigate to the D-Flash Backup section in the software. 3. Read and save flash file. Click read to start reading the D-Flash data from the FRM3 module. Save the D-Flash file to a location on your computer. 4. Data Repair. Navigate to the Data Repair section in the software. Click Open File and select the D-Flash file saved in the previous step. Click Write to repair the data. The software will automatically convert the corrupted D-Flash to a usable EEPROM format and handle the partitioning. 5. Wiring Diagram. Ensure the correct wiring connection between the Multiprog and the BMW FRM3 module. Use the following pinout for the connection, example for 2M25J slash 3M25J chips. Multiprog wiring diagram. HTTP sa două puncte dublu slash i punct imgur punct com slash revechiuygrechicz7.png. Detailed pin connections, example. 2M25J slash 3M25J chip pinouts. VCC. Connect to the power supply pin. GND. Connect to the ground pin. Reset. Connect to the reset pin. BKGD. Connect to the background debug pin. Other necessary pins. Connect as per the wiring diagram provided by Zorce for specific connections. 6. Final steps. After writing the repair data, disconnect the FRM3 module from the multiprog. Reinstall the FRM3 module back into the vehicle. Test the module to ensure it is functioning correctly and that the repair was successful. Key points. Automated process. Unlike older tools, the Zorce Multiprog automates the repair process, making it user-friendly and efficient. No manual partitioning. The Multiprog automatically handles the partitioning of the D-Flash to EEPROM, eliminating the need for manual intervention. Versatility. This tool supports various FRM3 versions, ensuring broad compatibility across BMW models. By following these steps, you can effectively repair a BMW FRM3 module using the Zorce Multiprog tool. This method is proven to be reliable and user-friendly, providing a seamless repair experience. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you found it helpful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below letting me know your thoughts or any questions you might have. Your support means the world to me and helps keep this channel going. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and share this video with fellow automobile enthusiasts. Together, we can make the world of car diagnostics and programming a bit easier for everyone. Until next time, take care and happy diagnosing.